it's Petunia Gal, and we are back over in a Planet Zoo. And we're going to start off on the Myers Rainforest Con Conservation Project. And uh, yeah, let's because. get to it. We can I pick have... our difficulty now. Um, I'm going to stick with medium. That's the um, one that it was to begin with. So we'll do a medium difficulty. And let's see what they have to say about this one. Hello there. Greetings from rainy Wales. From what I've been reading in the papers, I guess I was right about your boss, eh? Good on you for sticking it out with him, though. I'm not sure I would have had the self-control. Listen, I won't take up too much of your time, but you might be getting some interesting news soon. I've put in a word for you with a friend. Anyway, mustache, I think my dinner's burning. Keep your ears open. Okay. Welcome to your new zoo. Except it's not actually a zoo yet. Now, before you start, you might want to clean up the site a bit. There's a teeny tiny chance that there are massive amounts of toxic waste here. Even for a disused quarry, the no land is extremely cheap. Oh, and also extremely steep. So I suggest you build a gondola ride to get the customers around. I mean, I say suggest, but that's actually a direct order. Also, looking around the area next to the building site, I couldn't help but notice a lot of very poorly animals. I expect they must have gotten lost. Really, really lost. Especially the snow leopards. How about I arrange for them to be rescued so you can make them healthy? I think that's the right thing to do. After all, normally I'd have to pay for new animals. Plus, making them healthy again will really impress the inspector who I just remembered is coming. All right, off you go. All right. So let's see what we have here. So the first thing we need to do uh, has here that we need to remove a toxic waste barrels. So I think there's only like a couple, but let's see if we hit H and then we go to our temperature heat map. You can see there the little white, uh, white specks. So let's get over here. And you can also see there, uh, you can see a little bit darker red around them. Uh, if I can click it, there we go. So it's 1,200 just to remove these, which is crazy. And let's get rid of this one. All right, I think that's all of them. I'm not sure. Let's see, oh, there's, wait. Are these? I don't know. Should we get rid of? Yeah, let's just get rid of them all while we're here. Might as well. Okay. Now, is that all? Nope. It's still over here. No, it just says one, but. And that site is more uh, red, too. But I don't see anything in there, so I don't know. It's weird. All right, so let's go over here and make sure there's not any over here. I don't see any. Okay, so let's get out of our heat map. All right, so what I'm thinking is we'll go, uh, here's the entrance over here. And I think the best thing to do um, would be to go off this path. I don't know why. I double click that path. And it gives me something that's not even close to the path that this is. Um, I don't think that's right either. This one? So does that have the right... Um, oh, these are probably it. That's what I need. I think... Is it... I don't know. But let's go ahead and change the width a little bit. Okay, I think that's good. So what I think I'm going to do is have this curve around. I don't know if we can have it go up here, though. I would like to keep it at a slope, but I don't know if that's going to work. <clears throat> I did this. Oh, I know what I did. 
Let's see, I did this before, but I didn't do it over here. I forgot. So if you just uh, press and hold delete, we can get rid of those. Okay. So what I did was come off of this. And it's still really tricky to get it in the right spot. I don't remember where I put it. One thing I will look at is if we can change the terrain here. Because some of them you can change and some of them you can't. So let's just do that. And I think I'll bring the size up a little bit. Oh, we can. Okay. Awesome. I'm just going to do this. I'm going to uh, make a spot here. And then let's just do flatten to foundation. And I'm going to up the size on that. Just so we can have a little bit better area here. We don't have to flatten it all. We have kind of a gradual slope here. All right. So let's get out of that. Um, did we? We did. Oh, that's why. Because they're they're under the ground. I don't really care how that looks underneath. It doesn't. It doesn't matter to me too much. Okay, that looks weird. But there we go. So what I want to do is have this go out and through here. We'll move some of these if we can. I don't know. And then I'm going to, let's hit I. And I'm going to get rid of these because we don't need them. Will it let me? It won't let me. But I could delete these. If I just click on it. Nope. Okay, I could have sworn I could delete these. That's annoying. Okay. Well. I'm not connected to habitat area. I know it's not connected. Alright, well, let's go to facilities real quick. And let's go to staff facilities. We need a keeper hut. Uh, let's go down a little bit. Actually, I'm just going to play so it'll not be dark anymore. Because as long as this has scenery around it, it should be less of, um, of an issue for the guests. But I'm not sure. We'll do that. Um, and we need a staff room. I don't see a staff room in these. Do you? Quarantine. Research. Wait, wait, wait. What was... Staff room. Okay. I don't know where this is going, though. If this other side is going to be... Like, interfering with something in the building... I know a lot of the building is empty. Okay, I may have to turn off the snap. There we go. And then we need a uh, trade center. We don't need to necessarily have the trade center where it's um, like at a central location because it's not going to be used that much. Okay, and then um, we need a workshop, a uh, research center, that's what I meant. Is that the, no, that's not the front. I hate that the arrow isn't the front. It's really annoying. Okay, like I said, I'm going to go ahead and play. 
And these animals are sick that we're going to bring in, so we definitely need to do something about that. So let's go back to paths. Let's go to work uh, staff paths. And let's see. I'm going to go ahead and take that out if I can. If I, if I can. There we go. So let's see. We'll start with that. That one I can't do anything with. Why not? Okay, so it's it's a floating path. All right. Whatever. I'll take floating. That'll work. Whoa, that's crazy. I don't like that connection there, but okay. I don't like any of these connections, honestly, but, you know. It's what we got. Can we turn this around? Hmm. There we go. And, ah, I was hoping I could put it there. Okay, we'll just do this. Oh, I thought I had a connection right there. Oh, there it is. Well, that's good enough. <laughs> that's good enough. Okay. Let me look at the heat map real quick. And we'll look at negative impact on guests. Okay. So, yeah. That's that's nothing. All right. So, let's get out of that. All right. So, we need to build a habitat wall for our <coughs> snow leopards. We have snow leopards and a coffee in the trade center. So, let's get those out. Actually, no. We need to put them into quarantine. Forgot about that. So, I think if we put them... In the um, blueprint that we can put them over here, I think. Because I know we need these. Okay. Again. <clears throat> so, let's go ahead and we'll hit play. Let's go get our animals and our rewards. And we'll transfer them to the animal storage. And then get them out. Send to zoo. And we'll send them to quarantine. I don't know if we're going to make it. Because we're already really low on money. Let's go ahead and get a few staff. We'll get a caretaker. Oh, it's pause. I was like, why is that not moving? Never mind. And we'll get a mechanic. And. Okay, I think my game stopped. Come on. Oh, there we go. Just not going back to the uh, staff, but okay. And then we'll get a vet. A vet. Okay. We got to get this animal in here so we can get some money. <clears throat> all right, let's hit play so all those guys will fall down there. And then let's go ahead and get a barrier here. So, um, so I'll do, I'll just do red brick, I think. I mean, yeah, let's just do red so brick. Let's go ahead and do that, that and we'll change it. To a staff path. I don't want to change that. So we'll just leave it. Alright. So what I think we'll do. Let's go ahead. Do we have any messages that are quarantine passed? Um, okay. Just saying diseased animal discovered. Alright. That's fine. And then what's that? We need a workshop. Okay. Well, we'll get there. Whoa. Why is this why is this weird right here? Well, it's fine. They're still using it, so we're good. <laughs> so they're going to the vet. All right. So we got a little bit of an area. We may just use this for a copy instead. It doesn't look very big. Let's go to our um, Zoopedia. Come on. 
and we'll go down to actually we have a search option now so let's see how that goes <clears throat> oh I love it oh copy all right so they want 2.2 miles and okay and then the um uh snow leopard I was like what was the other one the snow leopard they want 1.4 miles oh okay so not that different okay well let's just go ahead and put the snow leopard in here then want to get uh, an animal that's gonna really you know that the guests are really gonna like I mean they'll like their copies too but oh wait uh, that Okay, move that one. And I will go ahead. Well, I don't know if adding a window in here is going to be that great. So I don't know if that's going to work out for us. They can kind of see through some of that. I don't know. We'll, we'll do it. <clears throat> and then just so we can get some of the money coming in. Let's go ahead and I'm going to switch to heart and let's go to all and we'll put down some donation bins because we need all the money we can get for these guys. All right. That. Okay. So let's see. Where where do you go? Oh, there you are. All right. So let's do wait what does that say many guests they think tickets are underpriced oh well if that's the case we can fix that let's do <coughs> five and four I think I don't know we'll see okay So let's go ahead and get these, uh, well, we only have one in right now, but let's go to habitat and we'll go to species and let's go down to snow leopard. This is where they need to add a, um, search option. Okay. Let's go ahead and get them. Well, they have water here. But we'll go ahead and put another water source there, just in case. And we also want a food tray. And I'll try to keep that kind of where where the people are. And let's go ahead and call Keeper. All right. Um, let's see. Let's put a little bit of a basic shelter over here. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. I didn't pay attention. I was like, I was like, what the heck is going on? Oh, jeez. Okay. I thought this was climb proof. Like, I thought the barrier itself was climb proof. Might be because of that rock. Let's see. Nope, nope, don't do that. I bet it's because of the rock. All right, let's see. We'll go ahead. Let's get out of that. All right. <clears throat> I don't really want to have to pay $1,000. Well, we'll go ahead and pay it. <clears throat> and when it gets back into the habitat, we will see if they can get it. Oh, I can't get it back. Okay, we'll see what happens. I don't know if they'll actually be able to get to it over here. There's no... I don't know. I don't think it matters if there's a path to it. I think they still go and get it. Let me do this real quick. I'm going to go to facilities. And we'll go to guest facilities. I want to put a restroom in here. Everybody's got to go to the bathroom every once in a while, right? So we'll have one right there. 
Okay, it's back in, so let's hit pause. <laughs> like make sure we don't do that again. <laughs> let's go ahead and hit H. And um go to habitat. Alright, just in case, we'll go ahead and hit play. Okay, so I think we're good. It doesn't show um it doesn't show it can escape anymore. So we'll just keep it playing. I want to go ahead and get the other snow leopard in. And then we need to get the um habitat, like the terrain and everything. Good. Let's go ahead and do that. So go to animals and that one's in quarantine. Let's go ahead and move that. Okay, so let's see what we need to do here. Um, temperature, it's too hot. Oh, this might, this might be a problem. If we add coolers, it's maybe going to be a little bit of a problem. Let's see, we'll add coolers. Yeah, yeah, I know, I'm working on it. I hear ya. All right, and then enrichment, obviously, they're going to want. Oh, they don't have enough uh, space. All right, let's go ahead and do this. I wish we could keep the animal panel up even while we're doing this. That would be super awesome. Why can't I do that? Oh, there we go. Okay. I know, I know, they're not happy. I get it. Okay, let's see. Oh, where are you? There you are. Oh, they're so pretty. Look at that. Awesome. Okay. Sorry, I just had to look at them for a second. <laughs> Hard shelter is not great. Um, Let's go ahead. I think I put a research. Did I put a research in there? Yes. So we'll go ahead and research the snow leopard. That way we can get some more stuff for them. But let's go to our habitat. And uh, let's see. Do we have... I don't see anything in there. If we do food, water... No, I want this. This is what I want. Okay. So they have climbable pieces and that's all. So let's see... We can put some climbable pieces here. We just kind of go up. Oh, that, that's not up. That's sideways. Okay, let's not do that. <laughs> let's do X. I seriously thought I was hitting shift there, but okay. Alright, so we'll do that. And then let's go to habitat. Um, let's see if we can just put a log like this. Or if we need to put an actual, um, something else, like, uh, this one over here. I don't know what it's called, but that one. Is that even, no, that's not even close. So you always have to, like, look to see if it's the right angle and stuff. So let's go ahead and do control X. There we go. We'll bring it up. I can't see because the thing's in the way. Okay. Oh, that's crazy. I'll just move it. Uh, let's go ahead. We'll just hit X. I should have done that in the first place, but oh well. We'll move it over here. Okay, let's just see if they can even climb on this. Let's see. Uh, enrich, uh, no, that's environment. Oh, what was I thinking? Well, if you go to habitat, this is under their enrichment. But this here doesn't have any climbable options. So I don't know. Let's go ahead and hit... H and let's look at uh, habitat 
So it's climbable, but I don't know if they actually need it. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Nope, not P. Uh, H. There we go. So they still want a bit more space. Let's check on the terrain. Uh, they want more short grass. Uh, yeah, more short grass. Less long grass. So let's go ahead. Give them some of that. Wow, they didn't want a lot. All right, and then they want less sand. Uh, we'll give them more rocks. I'm not going to do snow for now. I just don't think it really makes too much sense. But we'll do some rocks around here. And I'll bring the intensity way down to give kind of like a, kind of like where it falls away here. Where's the sand? It says too much sand, but uh, we'll put rock here. Okay, it does say they want snow, so I guess we'll put in some snow. Just to make them happy. And it'll melt wherever the coolers aren't close enough, but I think that'll be fine. Okay. And then the coverage, they're okay with. There's some of the trees that they don't like. Actually, all these have exclamation points. Uh, that's crazy. All of them have exclamation markers on it. But it's okay. Uh, biome is Asian taiga. So, let's see. Let's do that real quick. And then I think we're going to be done with this episode. But let's see. Nature... We'll do biome, what was it, taiga. And then we'll close that. Nope. Go to continent, Asia. Okay. I thought this was one they had in there that they didn't like. I don't know. But it's okay. I like these trees. These are cool. And we'll put some stumps here just coming out of the snow. Oh, I must have tit V, because I don't want a line to surface on. Because then if you let go of shift too early, it'll uh, move the thing where you don't want it. So, let's turn that off. Here's some carpet moss. Looks kind of cool. And I think what I'll do is shift and drag that down into the ground a little bit. Just have it kind of uh, in between, or in the middle of these uh, rocks, I think will be a good idea. I, mean, I like the carpet moss. I think it's a cool idea. Okay. So, um, how are they on... Okay, they're over on coverage. So, what if we get rid of one of those? Okay. There we go. Awesome. I don't know if they really care for the Jeep that's hanging in there, but <laughs> it's fine. So, there we go. I think these are good. The welfare isn't awesome. Let's see. Oh, enrichment. So, I don't think we've done any of it yet. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't think we've gotten that done. So, we'll add... Oh, wait. Here's some. There we go. Okay. So, let's see if we can add any enrichment real quick. If we could, we could get their... There we go. We get their... Um, Welfare up a little bit more. And we'll just put this guy over here. And I don't think we would get both. I think we need to wait. Yeah, we need to wait for the food enrichment. So they are doing pretty good. Still need a little bit more space. So I'll, I'll lengthen this out a little bit. Um, actually, we probably could just move this out. I'll move it over here. That should be enough. Okay. So, I think we did pretty good. We got our first animal in. Um, I need to fix up this building, but it'll it'll be fine. And then we need to put some education boards. And uh, like I said, they'll just clip through this. Um, the workers will, so I'm not super worried about that. The thing I'm kind of worried about is this is going to get super crowded. Because this is the only animal we have right now. Um, so yeah, next time we will see if we can add the copies. 
I may add some like um, shops right here and that'll hopefully get some more money coming in because we need that. We definitely need that, guys. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, definitely hit that thumbs up. Also, if you're new to my channel or haven't already, go and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell to get notified of videos as they come out. And if you want to play this game or check out any of my social media or Patreon links, they're all down below in the description. So check those out and come over and have some fun over there. And um, I think that's it. But if you guys have any questions, comments, tips, anything like that, definitely leave those down below in the comment section. I love seeing those, and we'll get back with you as soon as I can. And um, I was trying to find one of these guys to... Uh, show you but i don't know i'm blind but anyways so yeah until next time thank you so much for watching i hope you have a super blessed day and i will see you then bye guys